Hello everybody, Andrea Tarowski here. I'll be teaching you guys a little bit today about what to expect in your unique business. Now I saw this amazing, um, inspiring video on YouTube by Ella Whitaker. I hope I'm pronouncing her last name correctly, but um, she was awesome. And she's been a black level uh, presenter with the company. So the highest one possible, she's making the most money. Um, she's been with them for about three years now. It could be four years, depending on when that uh, YouTube video was made. But she made some excellent points of what to expect when you are a part of the company and certain things that you have to do to make it big in the company. And I just have to click something here because it says that the battery is almost dead, but it's not yet. So I should be able to do this last video. But um, anyways, so she made some excellent points and I would like to talk to them um, talk to you about all of them too. So when you're part of the company, you can choose to either simply buy the makeup yourself at a discount and not sell, you know, full time or part time. But you, you are probably a part of the company because you want to make some money, right? That's what I'm thinking. But a lot of people come to me and say things like, well, I need your help. I'm not selling anything. And I look at their social media channels and I'm not surprised to find that they're not posting about um, unique. People don't know they sell for uh, unique. They're not posting selfies, wearing the products. They're not posting three times a day. They're just simply not posting. Um, if I go on your social media feed and you're posting about cute animal pictures, that's nice and I will probably look at them too, but that's not helping you sell products. And then I have people come to me saying that they're spending all of this time on social media trying to market for their business, but again, I look on their social media feed and there's nothing there about unique or maybe there's something there once a week saying I sell unique by the newest mascara, it's awesome. That's not helping you. That's not helping you at all. So there are certain things that you do need to do to sell and make some money because if you're not doing these things, you won't sell. You'll become annoyed and then you will quickly give up because you're thinking you're not making any money, but it's not anybody else's fault. It's only your fault. So some tips that you need to do is have your own Facebook page, okay? And post everything about your unique business in that page. So if you're like me, um, teaching a class, doing a video, I would post this in my unique page saying, hey guys, I'm teaching a class today on how to market properly, you know? Am I selling? No, but people can see that I am actively working on the business so that down the road, if some if uh, somebody else says, oh geez, like she works part-time from home selling makeup and, sk and uh, skincare, I can see that she's always doing something so she must be making money or she wouldn't be doing it. So you are sort of planting those seeds in people's heads. You know, post about you putting your makeup on in the morning, you know, post a before and after picture, post a before and after video, you know, even a simple picture like my newest um, uh, lipstick, you probably can't see it and I'm not wearing it, but if I was, that would make more sense, you know, post a picture. Yay, <laughs> that's it. You're not selling it, but people can see you like the products. If you're not posting you liking the products, people won't buy. They will buy from somebody else, plain and simple. Um, another thing that you need to be doing is spending the time marketing your business. And this means networking with new people if you have to, talking to people who you have on your uh, Facebook list, saying hi, liking their pictures, commenting. That is something simple, but the more you do that, they see that you are liking um, their pictures, um, commenting, your pictures will start showing up more and more in their news feeds. So when you do post something on your personal page about unique, which you should be three times a day, they will likely see it. They may not buy for, um, uh, from you right away, but the next time they need a new lipstick, they will think of you and say, oh, hey, 
um, a friend of mine sells for Unique, maybe I will just talk to her. That's how these things happen, but you can't expect to sell if you're not posting, if you're not taking selfies, if you're not doing videos, then people just don't know you sell and then they will go to somebody else. You need to tell people what they need. You need to tell people what they want, but don't do it obvious like, hey guys, everybody needs this, you know? Don't do that. But the more they see you posting pictures of you looking amazing, they will want to look amazing too. It's it's that simple, but it doesn't happen overnight. So don't expect to be posting, you know, pictures three times a week or, or um, uh, three times a day and then a week later expect to make $800 in sales. No, but it does happen and it will happen. The more people see you, you uh, posting on your personal page, they will go, oh, I think she has a uh, Facebook page also. L um, let me be a part of that so that I can learn more about her, more about the business, and then there you go. Even if one person looks at it, they will tell somebody else and then they will hopefully post on their page also um, when they order their products, when they get the products in and say, yay, uh, thank you so much, um, Andrea, for my concealer. I love it, yay picture, you know. They can post that and then their uh, friends see that too and they go, oh hey, I'm in the market for a new um, eyeshadow. Can I talk to your friend, um, Andrea, who sells the eyeshadow? That's how these things happen. It's all about networking. And the nice thing about this, it's all done social media. So 24 seven, you do not have to be in front of your computer or laptop to sell. It's 24 seven stuff here, you guys, but you have to do it properly. So stop thinking, oh, this is too hard. I can't do this. I'm not making money. What are you doing to make the money? Are you talking to people every single day? It doesn't have to be about unique, but even like I said, liking people's pictures on Facebook, commenting, you know what? And then over time, send them a message saying, hey, your kids are so cute. Um, I see you work full time, you would be awesome. Um, to be a part of my company, have you ever thought about uh, cutting back your, your um, hours at work and being a part of a company with me? You know, like I'm just thinking.